guys, February 27th. She's got some good weather today. No rain in the forecast. Till tomorrow. It's coming tomorrow, it looks like. And every day after that for about the next four or five days. So we'll take advantage of today while we got it. What we got going on this morning is I've got to unload two trailers. So once that's done, we'll hook the tandem axle up to the truck and head over to Virginia and pick up some more walnut. He's got some more laid out there I'm going to choose from. One or two I know I'm getting. There's a few more I want to take a look at. And uh, I might make two trips over there today. It depends on how much we get from it. And hopefully by then, the feed store will call and the chainsaw will be ready to pick up. They said they had to put another sprocket on it so I could run my other chains. So hopefully that'll happen today also. So let's get to it. problem here on this trailer. Just a little problem. Well, it looks like due to all this rain we've had here, the stand has sunk into the ground. That's no surprise. We had about five inches last week. This place is still a swamp. It's better than it was, but it's still pretty mushy over here. So I'm gonna try to get it up there the best I can. Then we'll probably take a, just stuffed in a huge mud puddle right then. That was wonderful. So what I would probably try to do here is run a chain back here on the tongue and just hook that to the pallet forks and try to get some momentum here in this mud and drag it out of here then we'll worry about unloading it later. As you can see we got about three walnuts on there to take off. Good news is Broadwater just called and they had that sprocket in stock so they put it on the 880 this morning so I'm going to pick that up on our way to Dufffield to get that timber. This one thing's going right so far today.
Here we are, here in the valley, by the riverside. We have our peace, we have our freedom, if only for a time. We won't go on. No.